Residents in certain parts of the Bukit Panjang and Upper Bukit Taima estates will be required to evacuate their homes on Tuesday, September 26 due to a controlled detonation of a 100 kg World War II aerial bomb. Residents of the Linear, Hazel Park and Bukit 828 condominiums, the Hazel Park Terrace Houses, HDB Homes in Block 154 Gangsa Road, as well as workers in shop houses 778 to 822 on Upper Bukit Timer Road. Will need to temporarily vacate their premises during the disposal operation. The Singapore Armed Forces SAF Explosive Ordnance Disposal EOD team will conduct this detonation between 8 a.m. and 7 p.m. Nearby Greenridge Secondary School students and teachers will switch to home-based learning during this period, said the police in a statement on Sunday. The bomb was discovered last Wednesday at around noon. During excavation works at a construction site for the Miss Condominium along Upper Bukit Timer Road, the authorities were notified and the SAF EOD team has determined that it is unsafe to move the war relic. So it will be disposed of on site. A 200 meter safety cordon will be established around the bomb, and roads in the vicinity will be closed starting at 11 am on Tuesday. The police said. The public will be alerted when roads are reopened and it is safe to resume normal activities in the area. The Bukit Panjang flyover between Woodlands Road and Peter Road, as well as the stretch of Upper Bukit Timer Road between Peter Road and Cashew Road, will also be closed to traffic from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. to facilitate the bomb disposal. Only authorized vehicles from the police and SAF will have access to the closed roads. Traffic police officers will be stationed along affected routes to assist and redirect motorists. Parking restrictions will be strictly enforced and vehicles causing obstruction may be towed away. In addition, drone activities will not be permitted in the area during the operation. The authorities also anticipate loud noises during the controlled disposal of the war relic and advise the public not to be alarmed and to avoid the area. Foreign Minister Vivian Balakrishnan, who is also Member of Parliament for Holland Bukit Timer GRC, expressed his gratitude to residents for attending briefings on the detonation exercise. He mentioned in a Facebook post on Sunday that a temporary holding area for affected residents would be set up at Seni Cashew Community Club in Bukit Panjang. Dr. Balakrishnan assured the public that they would be informed about the operation's progress and when residents could return home. He also urged residents not to be alarmed and to cooperate with instructions provided by the police. In a similar incident in April 2021, a construction worker discovered a suspected war relic outside a temple construction site in Geelang, leading to the evacuation of over 100 people from nearby shop houses. In 2019, an unexploded World War II aerial bomb was discovered near the former site of the Zook nightclub and had been successfully disposed of on-site.